All right. So yeah. So you you have this uh, this drawing. Okay. Now, as you can see here, as you can see here, uh, make it sure that this one, that the position of your uh, uh, this grid line five and grid line A prime, this point is at the zero 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 in your auto add. Why? Because the the coordinate zero 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 of AutoCAD is exactly the same of the coordinates in Tecla structure. Now, if I type here CI, and then I specify the uh, zero zero zero, as you can see here, the the location the location of my model is already on the zero zero zero, and then make it sure. Make it sure if you're uh, using the uh, uh, the reference drawing from AutoCAD and bring to Tecla structure. Make it sure that your units, the units is in millimeter, okay, and your scale is one is to one or even one is to one hundred. That's fine, but uh, make it sure that the, your units in, is in millimeter because if this one is a different units, then you insert that one in Tecla structure, then you you will we will have an issue there. All right. So I'm going to close this one now. Okay, and then to bring this uh, drawing in Tecla structure, we must uh, select the reference model. Okay, select the reference model. And then, uh, add model, <clears throat> add model. So here you need to browse and I'm going to select this plan and hit okay. So as you can see here, you're upset because I'm, uh, the position of our drawing in our uh, AutoCAD is already in 0, 0, 0. Then your offset is 0, 0, 0, X, Y, and Z here. And then the scale, since that one is 1 is to 1, then you keep it 1 is to 1, unless otherwise noted, of course. Uh, rotation, 0. And then here, you simply click Add Model. And there you go. So you have now this uh, plan. So all you have to do is fit work area, and you can now start doing the uh, modeling here. But but of course, one of the uh, big question here is, hey, can we convert this uh, line, uh, this grid line to Tecla structure grid line? And of course, the answer is no. But uh, how we can easily uh, uh, match our grid lines to this grid line here. So of course, the uh, the default uh, way of uh, modifying these uh, grid lines is oh sorry, I think uh, my model is is not one is to one because if you notice here ah is it oh, let's let's check. 3,000, 3,000. Ah, yeah. I think it's one is to one. Sorry. I think it's one is to one. Yeah, 8,000. All right. Now, uh, going back to what I'm trying to say here is uh, if you want to uh, uh, match the grid lines to the grid lines of your uh, reference, okay, uh, you can just simply... Uh, Double click on the grid line, and then here, as you can see here, eight meter, eight meter, eight meter. You can just simply type here, uh, let's say five into eight meters, okay? Five into eight meters, something like this, and then it will match, right? Uh, but the problem is if you have a uh, uh, irregular or unequal spacing for the grid lines, then you have to type in, you have to key in the value here manually, one by one. But uh, what I can suggest, okay, what I can suggest is 
you can use the direct modification. Okay, you can use the direct modification. I don't know. Uh, this one may be, I don't know if you know this one already or it may be an additional information to you. But here, I can just simply select this grid and then move it here. And then this grid, move it here. This grid, move it here. Are you doing this, uh, this thing already? No. 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 No, no, no. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is Good that to new? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not new. It's been there for a while. But uh, I mean, of course, you know, usually. You just drag the grid, sir? Yes, I just drag the grid line. Mm, okay. Using the, uh, but make it yeah, sure that's that the, easier. But make it sure that the direct modification is on. Huh? But again, uh, I, I, I warn you that the direct modification should be on only if it is needed. You don't you don't keep it on because sometimes it uh, it doesn't help. Okay, so I mean that one is my personal uh, uh, recommendation that direct modification must be on if needed only. Yeah, but by default you just turn it off. So I guess this one is the easier way to match the uh, the grid since uh, we cannot convert the grid line. Uh, that the the AutoCAD grid line in Tecla structure, and also if you type the coordinates using this uh, uh, the value here, then it's uh, time consuming and also uh, not exactly I mean uh, easy, okay. Uh, but uh, using the direct modification and then move the uh, the uh, grid according to the. Uh, reference then it's much more easy it will be much more easier 